the kids and, and they had games and stuff and they had apples and you bought for apples, they could do this or that. And I, and I looked and I took pictures. I went through the place and I took pictures. They probably thought I was just, you know, off apple here or something. You know? <laughs> and I stopped after I walked through this whole place, I stopped and I, I said, could you tell me who, who the pastor is here? And she said, well, the, the head pastor isn't here, but one of the other pastors is here and he's right there. And he's, he's in charge of this. I said, good. I like this talk to him for a second. Didn't tell him who I was, okay? Didn't think it was necessary. But I thought, I looked at his brother, and I think he's a brother in the Lord. I'm not questioning that. I think they're just ignorant, okay? And I said, what do you think God thinks about this? What, what's going on here? He said, well, I never gave it much thought. Obviously. <laughs> the idea is the kids love it. It attracts people. It attracts people. That's what we want to do, right? Is attract people. No matter what it takes. And I said, well, actually, here's what God says. And I took him to some scripture. And I said, who, who is your head pastor? And he told me. I said, I'm not trying to be mean or anything. But I said, maybe you ought to have a little meeting together and find out if this is really what Jesus would have you to be doing. And that was all I said. And I walked out. I didn't condemn him. But I'm telling you something, folks. If God's people who know Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior can engage in this activity, something's terribly wrong. Something's ter Either we've discarded God's word, okay, and we've adopted the culture, or else we just don't care what God's word has to say. We just don't care. And yet, in my dying breath, I will not, I will not, have God's people do things like that, even if it attracts people. I want to see people come to Christ, but I don't want to use the devil's tactics in order to draw people to Jesus. God's word says we're to be in the world, but not of the world, okay? And we're to be insulated from the things of this world, but not isolated, okay? And so here we are in 